What is up, Saber fans? Jake, uh, Jonathan Cruz here, or John Cruz, however you guys want to pronounce my name. But <laughs> anyways, um, I have a very special um, Saber review for you guys today. And I apparently don't have a Saber stance, so this is the best I could do. This is a, <laughs> it's a box of fireworks, you see. <laughs> but it's all right. Um, anyways, um, trying to, there we go. All right, so I purchased this Saber three months back, mid-week of Thanksgiving. And I was super excited to get it. And by the time I pressed the order on this Saber, and I was like, Oh, it's coming! <laughs> oh man, I was super stoked that I actually got this saber. It's here. It's now here. Got here. It just got here t this morning. Um, and I was super stoked to open it up. And <laughs> of course, when you get a box like this from Saber Forge, you're bound to be excited. <laughs> but anyways, you guys, um. Enough about that, about my excitement. Um, let's go into the back history. The reason why I chose this saber is because it looks super comfortable to duel with. And um, unfortunately, that my first saber wasn't up to task to do dueling, even though it is sturdy enough to do full contact dueling. But um, I lost my charger for my first uh, saber, which was you know, a little disappointing, and I lost it, and of course, I know what you guys are going to say in the comments, why did you lose this, uh, the charger, but not to worry, you guys, um, I'm planning to fix my, uh, saber, um, let me show you guys my first saber, okay, this is the saber I first got from Saber Forge, it has the kill key, and this one right here is completely different than this one, so, um, let me put this down so I could get on to this, just this saber. Okay. So, um, I really like the way how it looks. The color combinations with the black, silver, and brass combination. And it just looks amazing. I really love the craftsmanship. And, however, when I opened up the package and I hold it in my hand... It looks, it feels very comfortable. Like, I'm not kidding you guys. The, the grenade section to this grip section down right here. It's super, um, um, it's super amazing. And it's super comfortable. So, um, yeah. Um, now let's get on to the saber itself. So, put this right here. Starting with the emitter. You got some gorgeous detailing right here. I really like the holes that they put around the inner ring um, towards the rim of the emitter. Got the blade retention screw for tightening for the blade, which I'll get to in a bit. The next section, of course, like I said before, I really love the color combinations with this saber. The um, black, silver, and, and brass uh, color combination grenade section really comfortable to hold no sharp edges is going to get in the way my hands are not blistering even though you see some red marks that's just me <laughs> uh holding the grenade section like this so um really comfortable so another grip section here and where's the kill key uh john um i know you guys are going to ask that question well if you guys did not know that saber forge has upped the ante for this saber um so uh for i think most of their sabers they uh, they pretty much up the pace for each of their sabers so instead of the kill keys um or i might be mistaken for this review but anyways i hear when you get three changeable um um sound fonts you're gonna get just this part of the port to be as a micro usb port for charging no kill key and this saber is in sleep mode and um i think there's a huge difference if you just order just one soundboard uh on the saber which is only probably one sound font you'll probably do get the kill key and 
for this one I have three changeable um, sound fonts. So the pommel is really nicely done. That gorgeous 2.0 CoverTech cover 2.0 nub and it's brass. Man, Saber Forge does not miss, uh, does not play around with authentic stuff such as the brass, and I just really like the craftsmanship. Speaker vents for sound. Very uh, nice uh, saber. Very nice uh, saber. So uh, it's the sleep moment right now. Like I said before, um, to turn it on, you just press the uh, button. Dark side relic. That's one of the sound fonts that's on this saber right now, and it has the blue AV switch right here. And I ordered this in deep blue 12 watt LED. So uh, let me just turn off the light really quick so I can show you guys. Okay, so, and here we go. <laughs> Very nice sound, very bassy sound, and it has blaster bolt deflection. And as you're pressing the uh, AV button for activation, there's also um, flash on clash for the blaster bolt. That's pretty cool. And also blade lockup. Let me try to simulate it right now. Oh yeah, that's the blade locked up, and just press the AV switch again if you are planning to undo the blade lock. Okay, now let's uh, change to a different sound font. I think the next one is Cyber Assassin. Let me check it out. Cyber Assassin. Yep, Cyber Assassin. <laughs> Uniquely different than all the other sound fonts and also ignition sounds. And this is also very bassy too. Okay, next sound fight is just played. Not really loud, but it'll do for now. Um, I just need to download the program so I could pick up the volume on this saber. That's why the micro USB port is all about. Lock up. <laughs> Excuse me, guys. Okay, let me get a blade to be put on here. And uh, what did I do with my tool of my island key? I know I had it here somewhere. Oh boy, your boy's tripping now, you guys. Your boy's tripping. <laughs> I know I have it here somewhere, you guys. <laughs> I know I just, oh, here we are. It's been right next to me the whole entire time, so. Yeah, turn off the light for you guys so you can see the blade in action. So, threaded tip, as always, with all their 
V4 Infinity Edge blade tip, um, blades. So, it's a really snug fit for this saber. And this is actually pretty cool. It actually works a lot better. Nice and tight. It's not going anywhere. Very nice. And now it's ready for full speed contact dueling. Very comfortable for holding. Right around here, here. Probably right around here is where I'm most comfortable to hold it. So, um, yeah, this is the uh, Exalted Champion Edition. I recommend you guys checking out Saber Forge's products because all their sabers are recommended for full speed contact dueling, which I really like. Because if you're a huge swordsman guy, and if you like lightsaber fighting, these sabers can take a beating. And it will last you quite a while. But if something does happen while you're dueling out there with a couple of your friends, and your saber's not correctly functioning, Saber Forge will be able to cover that with their warranty, which I'm really glad they do. So, uh, um, I'll leave a link in the description to uh, Saber Forge's website so you guys can check out their products and um, make sure you subscribe and uh, like this video and um, I'll see you guys next time may the force with be with you all always <laughs>